this winter wheat field today, and this field last year, it's about a 60-acre field, and this field last year got eaten almost entirely right out by Canadian geese and the swans coming in, and then the, the widgeon ducks come in here as well, really bad. So this year, this guy got on it right away, and he did something that was really effective. He took a banger gun, which is a gun we'll show you in the video as well, that you can purchase um, at Yonkun Equipment sells them, and they come with the caps, the bangers, and then the actual pistol itself loads it up and he came out here a couple times scared him off scared the canadian geese off um, worked quite effectively and then then made up these little scarecrows he made up as well which now in the last two and a half three weeks the geese have not been back because when they fly in now now they're thinking oh there's the same guy there again with the bangers so they've now tried to find a different location where they can eat where they're not getting bothered so a lot of the wheat now looks extremely good in great situation it came through the nice warm weather we had there the cold snap didn't do really anything to it it's in great shape really important we spent a lot of money getting the wheat established it's very important that we make sure we protect it from the geese and the ducks so a really good thing to do is to get one of those bangers, scare them off before they get habituated to coming into your field and feeding because once they get in a pattern and a routine, it's really difficult to break it out. So try and get at them right away and they come in with the bangers, get them off your fields and then make up these little scarecrows and put them out and it's really an effective way, a very cheap way to maintain your wheat uh, to keep it in good shape because once the geese come in they start eating it all the way down they're really bad they start actually pulling it out of the ground the swans are really bad because they're really a heavy bird and they muck it all up as well so the wheat's a very very valuable crop you have to protect it this is a very cheap and economical way with the bangers bang them off for the first week or two and that's really important to do that first um, so that when the, you put the scarecrows up the geese think you're still there waiting to get at them so a very cheap, effective way. Look at putting up some scarecrows up and then um, protect your wheat.